Arcantos! By the gods, I did not expect Mother Atlantis would send her best admiral to fight for me. Gracious words, King Agamemnon. And look at this. Ajax, I'm surprised to see you still drawing breath. These Trojan dogs keep trying, my friend. <laughs> Good to see you again. Who did you upset to get sent so far from home? Well, someone had to come and help you put an end to this. Helen is held behind their walls, and we've had little luck breaking through. We are about to change that. You have arrived in time for our final push, Arcantos. Get your men ashore. You can make your camp to the east, but be careful. The Trojans have some scouts in that area. When you are done, we will start preparations for our assault. Alright, this is a kind of cool mission. It's a quite a short one. Um, we'll mostly be using a fleet of ships to take down this map. Because we just need to take down the two harbours to get our victory. So this is one of the few maps where it is pure um, purely down to the fleet. So I'm going to want to build a dock there. I want to build a temple here. These guys and these guys can build one house. A stockpile there. And we're going to get some wood. Once you finish, you can get gold. So wood and gold are the two resources we need the most in this particular map. Um, food we will need a little bit, but not a huge amount, to be honest. The only thing we're going to be using food for is creating a couple of Cyclops. And yes, we will be going Ares again, because Cyclops are just really good at destroying buildings, and that's kind of what you need. Centaurs are really good at killing armies, but there's not really many armies to take out in this Those mission. Those ships are coming from the Trojan harbors. Those harbors are supplying the city. We must destroy them. Pop the law there because it's a um, drop-off point. The food. I'm not quite ready to siege any bases just yet. So there are three um, fishies to fish from. I'm going to put an extra two villages on food. You've got one to grab a little bit of favour. Because favour is not really something we need a huge amount of. We literally build like one, maybe two Cyclops. Third ship. Need to level, uh, age up. And grab Ares. For our Cyclops. Got plenty on food now. So now we need wooden ore. Or wooden gold. Even. So we can't actually build um, fleets until you hit age 2 and we'll be building mostly juggernauts because they are good against buildings um, and then a couple of triams just to tank for the most part. So we're going to need probably about I reckon like 3 or 4 triams and 3 or 4 um, juggernauts but we can rally as we go. Don't need to worry about upgrades this mission. Yeah, I say it's far too short for that. We'd like to upgrade these two Elder Cyclops, but it is a bit of a cost. It is a bit of a cost in terms of gold. I think we got too many on food. We can push one onto gold. I can push two onto gold at this point. Na, na. 
tell you what, the music in this game, woo! And I've mentioned it more than once now, but damn! It is the best kind of music to play RTS 2. To upgrade this to Elder Cyclops. Alright, this should be. Let me go transport ship. Let's draw these guys out. Grab one more ship and then we should be able to uh, take that fight. So we get quite a big army just from uh, taking down this base, which is kind of why we want to focus this one. Take it down ASAP Rocky. Avoid the town center. To be fair, the army is uh, a luxury we don't actually need in this mission. Good work! With the Trojan docks destroyed, Agamemnon's army can land! So the, the army is just a luxury we don't really need. We can just do complete the mission now with just the ships that we've got. Easy peasy. great thing about um, sieging it from the sea is you don't get hit by anything <laughs> once you take care of their ships. Which is just a free win really in that regard. I mean you can do it with the uh, ground army as well, you can, you can literally do it either way but ships is definitely the way forward for this mission in particular. That is all she wrote. Mm. 
Easy, bruv. Alrighty, folks. Well, that'll right about do it for the third episode of the Age of Mythology Retold campaign. Thank you all so very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel. It would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.